Welcome back. Over in Kermit, there's a good chance you've heard loud bangs and squeals lately, but don't worry, it's just a professional marching band gearing up for a performance of a lifetime. Local 2's Tyler Westner met with the squad at practice today. Horizon Drum and Bugle Corps, a West Texas-based professional marching band in the sound sports circuit of Drum Corps International, gearing up for their biggest performance of the summer season, the DCI Southwest Championships in San Antonio next Saturday. The idea of Drum Corps is this huge, almost international thing that's going on right now, and we thought that there's no reason why our West Texas students can't get that opportunity as well. Corps Director Paul Garza tells me the group is now 40 members strong, double the amount during their inaugural season last year. They're competing against bands with an average of 100 members in size, but they tell me that doesn't mean they can't hang with the big boys. At the end of the day, watching these kids do our run-throughs um, and kind of just, you know, put that product on the field, it's, it's very, very emotionally overwhelming sometimes, especially since we started from zero. The band is made up mainly from high school and college kids in West Texas, but they draw members from as far away as Louisiana and El Paso, where head drum major Hannah Vasquez hails from. I honestly really enjoy, you know, directing the music, you know, giving it direction and, you know, seeing the performers' faces. Like, I get to see them perform and, like, I get to, you know, give them energy. Vasquez says over at Kermit High School, they've been practicing for about the past three weeks and for up to 14 hours a day while dealing with the scorching West Texas summer heat. It's fantastic. Fantastic. Like, I have so much fun here, especially like the little things that make you realize that what we've been, like all the suffering we do here, it's just all worth it. Tyler Wessner, Local 2 News. Now, despite being small in numbers, Garza says they still can pack a big punch and don't count out the little guys in San Antonio next weekend. Peter Terpster.